Welcome back to Pep Talk. So, ang hanging question natin, did you guys always, uh, did you guys always wanted to be in showbiz? Um, Carl? Ako, um, gusto ko talaga basketball player. So, yun, yung, yung, yung nanalo ako sa B-Bench Model Search, uh, meron siyang contract na into showbiz. So, yun, nag-decide na rin ako na mag-showbiz na ako. Tapos, nagustuhan ko naman siya. So, tinuloy-tuloy ko. Hindi na. Tsaka kulang din yata ako sa hit, eh. Ano ba ito sa Ako, actually wala. Wala akong plano na if ever to join showbiz. Ang nangyari kasi sa akin, nung time na yun, um, I was studying culinary. So, actually, that time, nasa Dabao ako. I was, uh, nag-OJT ako sa Marco Polo Dabao, yung hotel doon. And three months ako doon, uh, nag-OJT. And after that, um, sakto, may nakaroon ng audition for Starstruck sa SM Davao. Culinary arts, that's really your dream ever Before, since? Yes, really. So, uh, Bakit yun? Parang, I mean, it's not very usual for a guy to like something like that. Really? I, I, kasi diba, cooking is for, diba, for women, Uh-oh. sabi nila. Tapos ngayon, parang dumadami nga yung guys na, na papasok sa ganyang field. It's weird kasi actually, yung totoo, yung sinabi sa akin, it's actually parang it's opposite kasi sa if you look sa mga chefs it's really rare na makikita ng head chef ng babae mm-hmm. so um I mean for me ang hindi ko before was really cooking like I think galing yun sa mom ko kasi she's she's a really good cook parang anything she wants to cook she can really do it kaya wala siyang recipe wala siyang alam sa food kasi pag nangita ng isang dish or something she'll say like oh I wanna try to make that mm-hmm. and she can make it so, parang na-inspire ko dun sa, sa mom ko. And after a while, parang I started noticing I really like getting into cooking and, you know, working with my hands. Ako. Since na mentioned ah. Steven na uh, hindi mo maging singer, mm. special request, sample naman daw. Oh my God. <laughs> sample. Um, what song? <laughs> Any song. Any song. Your favorite song. My favorite song. Let me see. It's been on my mind. Um, so yeah, some uh, fans and party. This is what we sang last uh, last week's party. Um, God gave me you to show me what's real. And there's more to life than just how I feel. And all that I'm worth is right before my eyes. And all that I live for. Though I didn't know why, now I do. Cause God gave me you. Si Carl, wala bang sample si Carl? Hindi pa patalo si Carl. Push up. Wait ito na, si Carl is gonna push up. Push up siya lang. Hindi, sige, eto. Kasi sa GMA, di ba, ang, ang dami ninyong mga artista, ang daming mga potential leading men. So, yes. for both of you, paano, anong pwede nyong gawin para ma-notice kayo na to become, you know, someone na yung bankable talaga na okay. leading man? Siguro sa akin, oo oh, nga, marami kaming mga leading man. Like, ano, um, kailangan mo talagang gumawa ng, yung talagang mapapansin ka, yung tatatak ka sa mga tao na, kasi, Mahit may anuman, talagang nadadagdagan ng mga artista. So, kailangan mo talagang magmarka sa anila. Kailangan mong galingan. So, anong ikaw, ano yung way mo to to achieve that? Siguro, um, workshops. Kailangan mong mag-workshop talaga, acting workshop. Kailangan mong pag-aralan talaga yung mga script na binibigay sa'yo. Kailangan mong role mo. Kailangan mong aralin. So, para, ano, para magbigay mo siya ng maayos. So, yun. Pero ano sa tingin mo yung parang unique na asset mo na wala yung ibang bilig na? Yung mga asset ko? Uh, What sets you apart? Siguro... Katawan na ba? Pansi mo talaga. Katawan. Gano'n siya. Katawan. Pani special daw kasi. Ay, yung mga... Siguro yun. Ay, yung katawan. Sabi mo, di ba? <laughs> Nagka-idea <laughs> talaga. How about si Steven? Yan. Ano naman I mean, yung ibibigay mo? Um, ang lahi ko talaga is for everyone who asks, it's Chinese, Filipino, and Portuguese. Kaya lang, ang dami, sa, ang dami nagtanong sa akin na if ever 
Koreano ka ba? Mm-hmm. Hapon ka ba? Parang Koreano. So, parang in like in Google, medyo iba, medyo unique. So, I think for me, that's that's one thing that I can like, you know, offer. It's really, my look is a little different. Pero alam mo, for guys like you kasi, lalo na dito sa Philippines, parang meron kasing, I don't know how to call it, pero merong parang sa mga audience, ano sila eh, very particular sila dun sa um, Pinoy na lumaki sa abroad or someone na may uh, half, kunwari half Portuguese, half ganyan, half Chinese, pero magaling magtagalog Ikaw ba na, na solve mo na yung, yung well, nagtatagalog ka naman ngayon, oh. but syempre iba yung sa scripts, lalo na sa Indio, mm. di ba? Medyo malalim yung mga Tagalog. How do you deal with that? Um, kailangan na like, practice Every day, nagpa-practice ako. Kasi, syempre, yung tao yung sinabi mo, nung, nung nasa Starship ako, eh, gano'n ako sa, like, I don't think some people know, kasi, even sa Starship, nung nasa Starship ako, eh, akala yung mga directors na ma-arty daw ako, kasi ay, ayaw ko mag-Tagalog. Mag, mag, mag eh, yung time na yun, wala akong nakihinting sa, sa Tagalog, as in 0%. Kasi, ang, um, yung situation namin sa States, my dad doesn't, my, eh, syempre, hindi siya Pinoy, so, yung nasa bahay kami, puro anong English lang kami, and lalo na sa States, um, eh, pati si mom din, hindi Tagalog yung first language niya. Marunong siya mag-Tagalog, pero ano siya, Tagadawa, so actually, she's more on Bisaya. Mm-hmm. So, um, that was one part for me, pero after Starstruck, that's when I started really learning. So, hanggang ngayon, nagpa-practice pa rin ako. Uh, pag may time, nagka-class eh, Uh, my tutoring sessions, so it's really, it, it really takes time, but I'm really putting all the effort. Okay, so let's go to Carl. Kasi diba, um, actually pareho naman kayo na nanggaling sa reality search, no? Pero, kasi like sa iyo, sa case mo, sa B-Bench, konti lang din kayo na, na nabibigyan ng break, ng big break sa reality search. Paano ninyo hinahandle nyo? Nafe-feel nyo ba na parang, hin- na parang napapabayaan ang career niyo apart from... I mean, aside dun sa man yung mga ibang kasabayan ninyo na yes. nabibigyan ng big breaks. For me, um, di ko, sa akin, hindi ko kinukumpara yung sarili ko sa iba. So, basta, basta may dumating sa akin trabaho, kailangan mong trabawin ng maayos. Tapos, yun lang, siguro timing lang naman eh. Timing tsaka focus sa career. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. How about for you, Steven? Hindi, I, I agree yung sinabi ni Carl. Uh, kasi feeling ko, yung sinabi ko kanina, never only expect na I would be pumasok sa showbiz. So, even uh, dahil na nandito ako sa showbiz, it's, it's also a blessing. And every time pagdating ng trabaho, I feel blessed for it. So, um, I also, I don't want to compare myself to others. Kasi, I can only control what I do. So, if ever na I compare myself to others, parang I feel uh, I could never win. Kasi, there's always someone that's better than you, better looking, And if you compare yourself, um, you're always just gonna lose. So you really have to do what you can do and really focus on your own career. As far as your careers are going, do you have a sense of disappointment? Do you have a feeling that you have to get deep rules? Do you have a feeling that you have to get deep rules? What? I enjoy what I'm doing. I like when I'm giving my lead rules. I like when I'm doing my job. Hindi pa yung parang kinakapa ako pa siya. Alam mo yung parang pag binigyan ka, magagawa mo. Tsaka ready ka. Tsaka ready ka. Oh. Yan din. It's like, sa mga times na, kung wari, like a downtime na wala kang show na ginagawa, uh, wala kang mga guestings, I think yun time na kailangan mag-workshop. Workshop. Kailangan mag, um, really you have to prepare yourself. Kasi pagdating yung work, eh, tuloy-tuloy yun. You really, can, you won't have time to prepare. You won't have time to do workshops na mag-improve. So yung mga times na, wala akong masyadong trabaho, that's when you also work on yourself and improving. And having said that, kayo ba ready na kayo for more mature roles? Like, daring roles? Daring? Yeah. Kasi nagt- nagtatopless naman na kayo sa pictorial, so given na yun. Pero, <laughs> like, um, mature roles, ay mga gay roles, or intimate scenes, ikaw, Carl, handa ka na bang gumawa ng mga ganun? Pwede. Kasi kung kailangan naman talaga sa story nung show, tapos kung hindi naman siya bastos, tsaka talagang interesting yung kwento, so bakit naman hindi, di ba? But how far can you go? How far? Siguro, ah... Uh, Sabi ko nudity, or kung gaano ka harsh yung scene, or... Harsh? Should you call it harsh? Harsh. Gusto mo yun, harsh. Hanggang saan? Gusto mo yun, harsh. Okay. Harsh. 
Pero yun, hanggang, hanggang saan? Hanggang saan? Um, depende kung... Kasama yun na uh, yung sa show na you have to do something na mga harsh. Na mga bad, or mga harsh. <laughs> Gawin na mga harsh na bagay. Mga harsh. Huwag naman sana harsh. Can we change the word? Huwag <laughs> naman parang harsh. Huwag yun eh. <laughs>